Princess Catherine has been going through a major health crisis, and there's been a lot of rumors, speculation going on around what's going on with Kate Middleton. I'm going to do an astrology analysis of Catherine's birth chart, the transits of the current planets this year, as well as her solar return and her progress chart. I'm also using my psychic intuition to see if I can give some insight as to what's going on with her. Princess Catherine, also known as Kate Middleton, was born January 9th, 1982, which was a Saturday at 7 p.m. in Reading, United Kingdom. She is a Capricorn sun sign, has the moon in Cancer, and her ascendant or rising sign is at 19 degrees of Leo. Each and every person born has an astrological predisposition for certain illnesses, diseases, and such throughout their life. Occasionally, when other planets are influencing your birth planets, health issues can arise. When I look at Princess Catherine's birth chart, I see she has the North Node rising, which can be an indication of problems at one time or another with the reproductive organs. Her Moon, square Saturn, can be associated with bladder issues, gallbladder, renal or urination problems, as well as the pelvis. Venus at 7 degrees of Aquarius in the 6th house can be associated with the fallopian tubes. When I look at her midpoints, I see that Venus is square Mars as well as Uranus, which sometimes points to abdominal operations. Saturn is conjunct the Sun and the North Node, which can bring on a hospitalization. As well as her midheaven, or midcusp is in opposition to Mars and Uranus, which also is an indication of operations. This year in 2024, there are four eclipses, and a couple of them are negatively activating Kate's Mars at 10 degrees of Libra, for one thing. There's an eclipse later this year at exactly the same degree. Also, the eclipse coming up shortly in April at 19 degrees of Aries is in opposition to her Saturn and a loose opposition to her Pluto. I see a rough year ahead possibly for Kate and I believe that whatever is going on with her health is extremely serious in nature based on everything I've seen so far. It could even be, have been cancer. The current planets in 2024 have Pluto transiting through her 6th house of health, which at times can activate an underlying problem that's laid dormant for some time or manifest a disease or bring about an ending. Removal. This transit of Pluto, it's heavy duty and it can be associated with a major health crisis, illness and operations. When I look at her solar return, I see her south node is at 20 degrees of Libra squaring the sun, which is also squaring the north node in the seventh house, interestingly enough. The first house is associated with a person's health, and the energy of 20 degrees of Libra is being energized by that eclipse on April 8th at 19 degrees of Aries later in 2024. Also in the solar return, I see that she has Neptune at 25 degrees of Pisces in the sixth house. My, my, my. The sixth house is also associated with health and mystery or secret illnesses and sometimes illnesses that are difficult to diagnose. It's also significant to note that there will be an eclipse once again later this year at, you guessed it, 25 degrees of Pisces. With the upcoming eclipse in April activating the North Node in her solar return, it's quite possible that there will be some changes to her marriage to Prince William as well, or there could be some trouble behind the scenes, some scandal may make its way to the public, whether or not it's only a rumor or actually true. And then when I lay the two charts, her natal birth chart with her soul return, I see the Libra planets are being activated and not in a very good way either. Next, I drew up a progression chart for Princess Catherine, and we can see the Sun in Pisces is in the 6th house, associated with health, as well as Mars at 19 degrees of Libra, which is in opposition to the upcoming eclipse in April. I feel Princess Catherine could very well have had a hysterectomy or some problem associated with her renal elimination. 
It's possible she may not be able to bear children anymore, and this may have something to do with why she is choosing at the moment to keep this private. Perhaps at a later time in the future, the reason will be revealed either through Buckingham Palace, some statement, the princess herself, or the information gets leaked with a tell-all book or something of that nature. I also see that she has some extremely difficult astrological energies around her, which will be in effect all year in 2024. It's quite possible she may have something to do with this problem resurface and some additional problem occurs. I also see she may have another procedure or surgery done in 2024 or shortly thereafter. She's not out of the woods yet by any means, I'm sorry to say. I wish her well and that she has a speedy recovery through whatever lies ahead for her health and strength in 2024. I wish her all the best. God bless and take care. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up and give me a like. Also, for future videos, please subscribe to my channel, Psychic Lisa Perron.